Our biggest danger is people not paying attention. It's just not fun. For Somerset Maintenance Assistant Foreman Donnie Sarver. I've actually been hit in an attenuator truck when I was an operator. The dangers of life inside of a work zone are something he knows far too well. A lady was reaching for her cell phone. When she looked up, there I was, and she panicked. Instead of hitting the brakes, she hit the gas. I wasn't hurt, but she was messed up pretty bad. Stories like these and the tragedies that have caused 45 turnpike workers to lose their lives on duty since 1940 is why the Pennsylvania Turnpike worked in conjunction with Pennsylvania State Police recently for Operation Orange Squeeze. Obviously the goal is to, to make people aware. It's not so much the, the enforcement side of things, but to make people aware of the, the safety aspect and how important it is for them to slow down. The initiative, done in conjunction with National Work Zone Awareness Week, had some state troopers trade in their cruisers for turnpike vehicles, where they monitored for unsafe behaviors like speeding and distracted driving across the turnpike system. If you're not paying attention to where you're going or what you're doing while you're driving on the Pennsylvania Turnpike, and you don't see a warning sign that, that could say that there's a hazard in front of you, then you're not going to catch that, and it could potentially cause a problem. When they see the state trooper cars, you know, with all the technology through Waze and Google, people are warning them that they're in the pattern. But if they're sitting in our vehicles, they don't know it, and, that, and that's a big plus. This was the first one conducted on the turnpike since before the pandemic. Last year saw eight reported work zone intrusions in turnpike work zones, resulting in two injuries. Those signs are there, you know, miles in advance. Um, and, and typically what I see um, when I'm working in the work zones is a, and in the marked cars that people generally will speed up to the point that they can't anymore. Um, and then they merge at the last second rather than getting over you know, with those advanced signs that are out there. PSP reported during the detail that troopers issued 436 citations, 395 warnings, and made two DUI arrests. Corporal Joe May said that while the short-term results can change some people's behavior. question is, three months, five months down the road, how, how does it play out then and what does it look like then? And, you know, with uh, people running the work zones, we just don't want anybody being, um, you know, lackadaisical and, and kind of putting it off on the what they learn, you know, with the pre preceding months. Police presence is very important in our work zones. Uh, the Somerset Barracks does an excellent job working with us, and if they have the manpower, they're out there. Sarver said customers should respect work zones the same way drivers would want their workspace respected. These guys want to go home at night and to their families just like everybody else does.